Hey YouTube, today's video I'm going to teach you all how to determine the direction of flow in a color Doppler image. So to determine the direction of flow, I prefer to use the home line method for the transducer because to determine the flow, the main things we need to know is where our transducer location is and what colors are on our color map. So which colors are coming towards the transducer and which colors are going away from the transducer. So to determine the direction, you're gonna need your color map and to know where your transducer location is. Also, these directions are the direction of flow on the screen. They are not relative to patient position, so it won't be superior or inferior. We're gonna be doing left to right and right to left. So for the home line method, I'm gonna start by drawing an imaginary line from the top of the color box all the way down to the bottom. This line is inside of the color box, so this is not our transducer location. On this side, on the left, I'm gonna draw an imaginary line down. This line is outside of the color box, so this is our transducer location. You wanna make sure the imaginary line you draw is going to be outside of the color box. So now we're gonna look at the color inside of our vessel in our color map. So we have red inside of our vessel, and we know that red is coming towards the transducer because red is at the top of our color map. Top is going to be coming towards the transducer. The color at the bottom is going to be going away from the transducer. So since we're coming towards the transducer, we're going this way because we're coming towards the transducer. So the direction of flow is from right to left. So for this next image, our transducer location is still over here on the left because we are still steered the same way. Our box is steered the same way, so our transducer location is still the same. But now the color in our vessel is blue, and we know that blue is going away from the transducer. So we're coming this way, meaning that we're going from left to right. So now our color map is flipped. Our transducer is still steered the same way, but our color map is flipped. So blue is coming towards the transducer and red is what's going away from the transducer. So our transducer location is still right here. Our transducer location is still the same because our box is steered the same way. But red is now going away from the transducer. So we're leaving the transducer. So we're gonna be coming this way, which the flow in this vessel is going from left to right. So now the color in our vessel is blue and we know that blue is what's coming towards the transducer. Still have our transducer location over here. We're coming this way. We're going from right to left now because we're coming towards the transducer. So now our box is steered the other way, so we need to figure out where our transducer location is. So I'm going to draw that imaginary line from the top of the color box. This line over here on the left is inside of the color box. This is not our transducer location. I'm going to draw another imaginary line from the top of the color box all the way down. This line is outside of our color box. So this is our transducer location over here on the right. So now looking at our color map, red is on top, blue is on bottom. We have red in our vessel. So red is what's coming towards the transducer. So the directional flow in this vessel is from left to right. So now the color in our vessel is blue. We still have the same transducer location. We're still steered the same way. So our transducer location is still over here. We have blue in the vessel now. Looking at your color map, blue is on the bottom. Blue is going away from the transducer. So we're leaving the transducers. We're going to be coming this way. So the directional flow in this vessel is from right to left.
So now our color map is flipped. So now blue is on the top and red is on the bottom. Blue is going to be coming towards our transducer. Red is going to be going away from our transducer. So our transducer location is still over here on the right. We're going away from the transducer now. So the directional flow in this vessel is going to be from right to left. So now the color in our vessel is blue. Blue is on the top of our color map. So we're coming towards the transducer. So we're going to be coming this way towards the transducer. So the directional flow in this vessel is going to be coming from left to right. I hope you all enjoyed this video and learned something from it. And if you have any questions, you can leave them down in the comments. And I will see you all next time. Bye.